How's it going? Carl here. Today in Power BI, we're going to be doing a scroller. We're adding a scroller to the Power BI report visual, and we're going to go ahead and get more visuals. Show you guys how to do this. Just going to type in scroller, and you'll see it here. It is certified by Microsoft, which is great. We're going to click on that. It's going to load. We're going to add it here. Import it to the visual successfully. And we see it right here. If you hover over it, it says scroller. So we're just going to add it here. And usually when you see a scroller, it's something like you see on a news channel. Or if you guys watch ESPN like I do, you always kind of see something scrolling across the bottom of the screen. And let's see. What we want to do is we want to add something. So let's do some product categories. So we're going to add a product category. And then let's just add sales. So if we add product category and we add sales, we see it's scrolling across our visual and it's kind of laggy. And then you see it got some weird numbers here. So how do we change that? So if we come here to sales and we come up to fix decimal numbers, we can change this to a whole number. And it's going to ask you with this data tab, you're stored differently, yada, yada. You can just cancel that and instead of doing that let's go to auto and let's put it at zero and now we can see what that looks like if we want to go ahead and add the sense we can add two and now we can see what that looks like as far as the scroller now here are some things that you can do with this scroller you can click on the scroller and go into format the visuals you can also um, change the measure deviation so for all the ones that are positive it's going to show an up arrow and then for all the ones that are negative it will show a down arrow so we'll just leave it there for now and then we'll go into format visuals for this scroller there's a lot of things you can do is it's an auto size for the font you can turn that on and it'll just fit the font to what makes what they feel like makes sense and then there's a status indicator you can turn that on or you can turn that off then there's a status indicator color and then there's status text coloring and then we can increase the font size as well as increase the scroll speed so the speed that is going right now is pretty good but if perhaps we wanted to increase that we can just put it on five and it'll just scroll like we're sitting at the new york stock exchange and watching all the numbers go by so we'll just try to bump this back down to something like two then another thing we have here is custom text. So if we come here and type in custom text, we would just say, let's just call this sales. And now we got sales scrolling across the screen as custom text. And we'll just have a scroller that just has the custom text. So we'll just get rid of that. And then we'll get our visuals back. And then we have text color. So we can come here and change the text color. So we can make this light blue we can change this back to white as well as change our background color if we wanted to change it to something like that or just leave it black and there you have it that is how you create a scroller visual in power bi